Hi guys, just a quick video talking about testing out painting techniques. How often do we paint a figure, start it off, I'm going to do this colour, I'm going to do that colour, this is going to look great, and then it just doesn't work. So one of the big tips I can give you is, let's utilise our junk. So things like yoghurt pots, it's got corrugated, style effects, crumpet case, probably strawberries or something. These bits of junk, which we've always got tons of, are brilliant for testing out any painting ideas. So it's always worth having one chucked to one side. If you want to do some air spray and spray it, is the paint the right texture? Is the blending right? And then move it onto your figure instead of having to try and strip the figure or redo the, over the top of the figure and blend it back down. It's a lot easier. So I get these some bits primed up and cut out, and we'll have a look at a couple of techniques. Right, back again. Um, we sprayed up a couple of bits of yogurt pot, so we've got the corrugation and just a piece of plastic I cut, sprayed it white. This white paint's pretty well had it, it's powdery and horrible, but it'll do for what we're going to do now. Um, first thing, so we're saying we can use this for practicing, so if we need to do a bit of dry brushing, get some paint. I think this paint's probably beyond dry brushing, maybe. Yeah, that one's a bit had it. Let's go and try and find another pot. I'll be back in a second. Right, grab some different paint. Let's give it this quick go then. Let's get some more paint off of there. So there, we can see we've got a heavy effect. A light brush, a dry brush, to be more of a nice effect. So we might try going the other way. And camera. One. I prefer going this way. I think looking at it. So from using a scrap piece, I can have a look. Does it work going across it? Does it work better going down it? And I haven't wasted any figures. Now I have a quick look at doing a blend, wet blend effect. So let's put these to one side and we move on to the white. I'm going to quick play with some wet blending effects. These paints are on a wet palette. Blend bits out if you don't like it. It's, this is where it's great, you never play, you see what works, what doesn't. Okay. It's like a portal style opening. It's very grainy because the primer is very good. Not very good, I need to chuck it. Right, guys, the white one just did not work. The, basically, the primer is gone old and dusty it's probably 20 years old to be honest as I don't tend to use Citadel primers anymore I just thought oh, I'll use a bit of that I'll do the job and I was proven wrong so that's something for the bin um, but you get the idea we can use scrap bits of plastic for trying anything out great for airbrushing absolutely love getting the piece out for an airbrush spray over it blend down does it work have I got the paint texture right is it going to powdery is it blowing out everywhere is the pressure right um, you can do that without mucking anything up it's just a piece of scrap plastic so save your scrap, um, cut it down into piece, test pieces if you wish, so you can stack it all up in a little pile, you can just grab a strip when you need it, instead of having loads of boxes everywhere and people getting grumpy at you for taking over the house. Um, and that's it guys, take care and I will see you soon, cheers.